Alright folks, so here we're looking at a clip from another Joe Biden event where he is speaking. He makes a comment, okay, where he says, and this is an issue that exists in terms of how do we, you know, uh, reconcile the coal miners because obviously mining coal is really horrible for the environment and so we need to stop doing that and we need to reroute the people who are working there and how exactly do we do that. Uh, there's some pretty clear plans, like, you know, AOC's plan is basically to fully fund their pensions and then invest in, uh, you know, re-education, uh, into, like, different training of jobs. So, you know, anyways, let, let's let him take it away. He's gonna say that they can learn to code. I come from a family where, in an area where it's coal mined in Scranton. Anybody who can go down 300 to 3,000 feet in the mine, sure and hell can learn how to program as well. <coughs> But we don't think of it that way. Even my liberal friends don't. The president asked me to get Detroit out of its problems. Remember, Detroit went bankrupt. And he gave me authority to do whatever I needed to do. So I set up with all. And so we went out and hired this outfit that the major corporations hire and they need IT. They went out into the neighborhoods. They found 54, happened to be all women, not by intention, mostly women of color, with a few exceptions, ages 24 to 20. Yeah, 24 to 52 or 4. They went through a 19-week training program at the community college there, learning how to program. And I remember telling people this, and my liberal friends were saying, you can't expect them to be able to do that. Give me a break. Anybody who can throw coal into a furnace can learn how to program, for God's sake. No, that's not true. This is a very embarrassing clip on the part of Joe Biden. Um... No, not everybody who does coal mining. And apparently they don't throw a coal, a coal in a furnace. I don't know. But no, that's not true. Not everybody who's a coal miner can, you know, learn how to code. Uh, learning to code is not easy. Nor is it really in any way even closely related to that. So obviously we fund their pensions, right? And then redo retraining for a different job. But, you know, there are plenty of like infrastructure building jobs that are necessary, like building roads and bridges and paving roads and all that kind of stuff. Uh, there's all kinds of infrastructure work that we need to be done uh, that are, you know, and that's more similar to coal mining than something like programming. Like no one's going to want to do that. Now, if they want to learn how to program, then that program of retraining jobs, sure, that'll, that'll allow that, you know, that'll fund that. But kind of a ridiculous comment. Now, people are laughing at this. Some people are laughing at this who are right-wingers because um, there was a meme. There was a meme called Learn to Code. It was a saying. This was at the time journalists were being laid off left and right, and so they would meme and say, well, learn to code, you know, bye-bye, learn to code, you know, uh, because, oh, you know, your job is not in demand, so go learn to code. It was a meme that was being used against journalists who were being laid off. So right-wingers are laughing because, you know, it's using that and then some left-wingers are laughing because of that as well, just because it's a, I guess it's a meme. But also, you know, people are laughing uh, because of just, you know, how, kind of how ridiculous this is, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you're not, like, going to get most of those people to be coders. They're just not going to, you're just not going to learn to code. It's not going to be their thing, okay? So, what you need to do is fully fund their pensions. We need to invest in uh, job retraining. And we need to move out of the Stone Age is what we need to do. Um coal you know obviously mining for coal is horrible and there aren't even like when you add up like the total jobs that exist for coal mining i mean it's really not even enough and so moving forward to sort of change those jobs is actually beneficial for the coal miners themselves as well so that's what we need to do um and joe biden kind of comes off a little bit uh, a little bit funny here